another tips and tricks video brought to you by Accident and Acer. In today's video, we are going to take a look at tasks and how they can be assigned to individual people and how you can easily find any documents where you have tasks assigned to you. And this is a great way to help you keep organized, to keep you on top of the things you need to work on. And so let's go ahead and take a look. Now, tasks are something that can be assigned to any file that you have uploaded in your Google Drive. That includes docs, sheets, slides, even PDFs and image files you can assign a task to. So it works the same across all of them. You open up your document and we'll look at it in PDFs. Once your document loads, maybe you found a specific word or something you think is really important that we need to consider. Is this really the best for somebody? You can just highlight whatever it is you want to do and then you add your comment off to the side. Same thing in docs, same thing in slides, same thing in sheets. You add that comment and then when you're adding the comment, you need to type someone's email address or if you're working with a workspace that has all of the names listed and attached to the email address, you can just type their name. But for example, I'm going to type one of my other email addresses here. And then you see this option with a check mark next to it that says assign to this person. Give it a check and click assign. Super easy, that task has now been assigned to my other alias and I will get an automated email telling me, hey, there's a task you need to work on. But we also know Emails can get lost, can get confused, can get bogged down, especially if you're getting so many tasks assigned to you. And that's when we need an easy way to find out which documents you have to do something in. So to do this super easy, you just go to your drive. And the first thing that you can look for in a document is in your drive, in the top right hand corner of any document, you'll see a circle in gray with a number inside of it. So for example, here we can see I've got my gray circle with a number one inside of it. And this tells me I have one task assigned to me in this document. I can click into another folder and I can see this document has one task assigned to me in it. But again, that's a lot of clicking, opening things, especially if you're using a shared workspace. So there is a significantly quicker way to find all of the things across all of your shared with me, shared drives, private Google Drive folders to see what you need to work on. And to do this, you are going to come to your search bar and you're going to go to the advanced search slider and then down at the very bottom, you have a drop box that says follow up. If you click in that, you change it to action items only. And then you click search. And again, this will search through your private drive, any shared workspace drives, any files that have been shared with you, and any that have tasks assigned to you where someone has tagged you and said, yes, do this are the only things that show up in this search. And I can see all of them have that gray circle in it, but they're the only things here because there's something I have to work with. And then I go ahead into one of these files. I complete my assigned task. I go ahead, I give it a check, I finished it. If I come back to my search results, we can see that number one in the corner has disappeared as soon as I click that check mark, and then if I give my search a refresh, that document is no longer going up to show up in my search options. So this is a fantastic way to keep track of all the action items you need to follow up on, that you need to deal with, that are hiding somewhere in your drive. So again, super simple, get everything in the same place, your advanced search slider down to the bottom, change it from the dashes to action items only, 
and give it a search and you'll never lose track of things you have to do again. I hope this tip helped you and we look forward to seeing you back next time for more tips and tricks.